In this project, we decided to build on our previous efforts to visualize New York City 311 call complaint data. One of the most intriguing insights we found in exploring our data in Project 2 was the way complaints correlate with race and income. In order to dig more deeply on this issue, we used demographic data from the U.S. Census Bureau's American Community Survey and combined it with the new selection of 311 call complaints. To make these insights visible, we added a scatter plot on the right with the number of complaints on the y-axis and the relevant demographic statistic on the x-axis. Then we also built in a least squares trend line to make the patterns clear. Hovering over a data point in the scatter plot will highlight the corresponding zip code on the map and vice versa. And also up here we can select the complaint that we want to view and on the right we can select the demographic that we want to compare it against. Um, Clicking on a zip code or on a point on the scatter plot will also select a zip code to have the bar chart at the bottom represent. Finally, to enhance the user's understanding of our story, we decided to offer a number of pre-built views. Up at the top right, we've included four, including plumbing against the percentage of white people in a zip code, and you can see that there's a very clear downward trend line, or say graffiti against median income, where the negative trend is even steeper. Uh, we hope uh, you will find our visualization interesting and compelling. Uh, I'm Tommy Heffernan. And I'm Jonathan Yip. Thanks for watching.